The election of 1860 was between presidential candidates Abraham Lincoln, Stephen Douglas, John Bell, and John Breckinridge. Lincoln ended up winning the election, and his main goal was to fix what had been broken, the Union. Because of this, the southern states started to withdraw from the Union in fear Lincoln was planning on abolishing slavery. This chain reaction of the South seceding is what set the stage for war. Since the beginning of the 1850s, the Union was divided from questions of states and slaves' rights. When a powerful figure finally came to front the issue, the Pub Republican Party came to power and not a single southern state was in favor. I believe this drew a distinct line between the North and the South, and now that the South hadn't been getting what they wanted, it was the final straw before war.